Hey guys, what's up? This is the Bandos video with the Elder Mall. So what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be using the Elder Mall at Bandos with absolute max strength bonus. So I got Berserker and I, Primordial Boots, Amulet of Torture, complete max, 197 strength bonus. That's huge, along with 165 crush. So we're going to see how good this thing is here. And uh, there's just some clips playing in the background. I'm just really testing this thing out because I was curious to see if it's the new best uh, weapon to use at Bandos instead of the, the Whip Tentacle. And uh, it hits pretty high. So the max hit on this thing is uh, it's a 64. That's uh, it's all right, I guess. I Honestly, I was expecting a little bit higher hits from 197 strength bonus weapon, but I'll take it, right? So overall, it was, it was a really fun weapon to use and everything. And um, I'll just let you guys watch the rest of this and I'll come back in a bit. And that's it. So guys, um, this weapon, you know, honestly, I really like it. I feel like they should make it just a little bit more stronger, maybe like a max hit around 68 or even up to a 70 because it just, I don't know, it has such a huge strength bonus. It just kind of feels underwhelming and it, it doesn't feel like it's accurate enough. Uh, if you're comparing this to the Whip Tentacle of Bandos, I would honestly give the edge to the Whip Tentacle because I just... Uh, I those are the best that was like a two and a half hour trip that I that this video is compressed into and those were the best clips I could manage out of it like it, it's really inaccurate at Bandos I don't know about other places obviously PKing is probably what it was made for but at Bandos it's just it's very inaccurate you get those high hits sometimes once in a while like a couple in a row but um 
the whip tentacle is definitely a better choice if you're going to be doing that. And I feel like the whip tentacle is just, it, it all matches it and everything, you know, it's faster. You can bring a defender if you want, so you can have even extra accuracy on top of that. And uh, basically, yeah, if uh, I, I would definitely use the whip over the, the mall, the Elder Mall Bandos. So basically what um what I'm going to be doing now is I'm just going to be selling it back to the Grand Exchange. You can see how much. I bought it for 108 mil. So you you guys can see what I'm selling it back for in a few moments here. But um overall, I, I really feel like it's overpriced too. Right now, 108 mil, that's, that's a lot of money, right? A lot of people don't have that lying around. I definitely didn't. I had to sell a bunch of things. So I would say it was a fun weapon to use and everything, but it's probably... I'm probably not going to buy it back until it's around at least 30, 35 mil-ish. So there's me selling it there, 110 mil. And uh, thanks for watching the video, guys. That's it. Peace.